For those of you wondering about the Red Hydrogen One, it finally has an official release date and a price tag. It seems that Apple finally found out that their phones are too expensive and are developing a new strategy for it. And Verizon is offering a buy one, get one free deal for the Galaxy Note 9 already. I'm Jaime Rivera. Thank you so much for 1.6 million subscribers. For all your support, it means a lot to us. This is Pocket Now Daily. The official news today begin with deals that we weren't expecting. I mean, usually BOGO deals come until much later after a product gets announced, but the Galaxy Note 9 is not going to be announced until two days from now, and we already have Verizon teasing buy one, get one free deals. If you pre-order it on the carrier, you can learn more in the description. Definitely worth it, but there's no price tag yet. Now let's talk about HCC as some concerning news are coming. Definitely the U12 Plus has proven to not be the phone the company needed. 56% down in revenue. Uh, we hear profits are already plummeting as well. Definitely the company needs another strategy, but I'm concerned that they're talking about cutting another 1,500 jobs. Whatever the case may be, we'll keep you posted. We're hoping the company figures this out. I mean, this whole industry owes itself mostly to HTC, so I definitely want them to figure it out. Now let's talk about the Oppo R17. I mean, we already saw the R15 Pro, which was barely announced a few months ago in China. We were there. Uh, but now we have a, a TINA certification for the R17, and apparently this is the phone that brings the 10 gigs of RAM in addition to also the Gorilla Glass 6. We also have a teaser for the F9 Pro, and it's the first time that we see the Pro being used on the F lineup. I can't wait to see what we get here. Now let's talk about iPhones as it seems uh, Cupertino has just figured out that their pricing is just too crazy for the smartphones up to the point where we hear that the strategy for the iPhone in the future is that the LCD iPhone is always going to be sold. Uh, and the reason being is that the company wants to sell a product that's not so crazy expensive. And they're so focused on the Chinese market that we even hear rumors that there will be an exclusive dual SIM variant of this LCD iPhone. Uh, again, at a price tag that's going to be more aggressive. Let's just see what aggressive means because Apple has only proven that once and that was with the iPad and that was it. And finally, the hot news today have to do with a product we didn't think was going to launch. The Red Hydrogen One is apparently going to be available for those that pre-ordered and that became part of the whole scheme of this product. As of October 9th for everybody else, apparently November 2nd is going to be the date Price tag $1,250, $1,250. For the starting variant, for those of you that want the titanium one, that's not gonna launch until next year. Uh, we're not exactly sure on what dates, but yeah, this is the Red Hydrogen One. Uh, in the comments, let us know, what do you think? Would you be willing to buy this phone? Because in my case, I'm just concerned that right now it already has last year's specs. So what are we getting next year for the titanium variant? Are we getting two year old specifications on this phone? Uh, whatever the case may be, let us know in the comments. Friends, again, if you want to get the news earlier, follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to both our channels, English and Spanish, for more videos like this one. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I'm Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.